What's up guys and welcome back to the channel. In today's video I'm gonna teach you how to add portfolio to your Shopify store so make sure to stay until the end of the video. But before we move on it would mean a lot if you subscribe to our channel and hit that notification bell as well. So you need to log into your Shopify account and go to online store, select teams and then go to the customize uh, of the team you want to customize and click on the portfolio tab. Next, click on add section button and this will open a new window. So basically online store, go to teams, select customize the team you want to customize and then click on the portfolio tab. Next, click on the add section button. This will open a new window with a list of available sections. Scroll down until you find the portfolio section and click the add button. Once the portfolio section has been added, click to the configure button and this will open a new window where you can configure the settings for your portfolio. So basically what you want to do is go to the online store, select the teams and just find the portfolio as you can see over here. When you click on customize, you need to select portfolio. So after customizing, uh, you can just find the portfolio option over here. So as you can see, you can just go add section over here to the header and to the template and to the footer. It doesn't matter where you want to add it. Uh, it's up to you. After an ad selection, you select uh, portfolio section and click the add button. As you can see, let's say we want to add it to the template add section. Uh, let's see if we have a portfolio. We don't have it over here, over here also not have it so basically it should be here somewhere so you need to find it maybe i am not uh, able to see it because i'm still uh, this account is currently on the uh, on the free trial so possibly i cannot see the portfolio so once portfolio section has been added click on the configure button and in the portfolio setting window you can choose to display your portfolio on either a grid or list layout you can also choose whether you want to display the titles of your projects caption or both if you want people to be able to filter your projects by tags make sure the enable filtering option is enabled once you've configured the settings for your portfolio click on save button and that should be it so from the teams go to customize and basically select a portfolio over here so basically guys that's it for today's video thank you so much for watching and see you in our future videos goodbye